One thing I know, if I ever do run for anything, all I need is Robert Wilder's endorsement. That would do it. They call the election right then and there. But in the meantime, enjoy this very fresh edition of Edge on the Street. All right, guys, we're talking about endorsements of politicians. Your favorite subject? <laughs> yeah. Eh, really? No. That's sad. Okay. Has an endorsement ever affected your way of voting? Honestly, no. Why not? I could care less about what other people have to say about me voting. Uh -huh. And I really don't vote that much. You don't vote that much? No. Nope. Maybe you just haven't found the right person to endorse the candidate. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> A lot of entertainers want to influence voters. But I don't feel many of them know a lot about the issues. And who's to say that somebody's going to actually listen to them and vote their way? Exactly. Has an endorsement ever affected your vote? Oh, God, no. Nah. No. You can think for yourself? Yeah. Yeah. The issues are what's important. That's true. So yeah. if Tim Tebow said, hey, I'm Tim Tebow, I want you to vote for blah, blah. I would especially not vote for that person. No, I'm kidding. No, I, I no. no. you're not. You're it, do, it, it, does not, it does not sway me one, one way or the other. No, I mean, I think I try to make my own decisions. However, if I see a, an op-ed opinion or an endorsement, I might try to listen to the reasons why. I do my own due diligence, and I do not uh, pay particular attention to endorsements. I make my own decision. Mm -hmm. You're your own person. I am my own person. Are you your own person? Yes, I am. Mm -hmm. You have your own brain? Yes. Think for yourself? Yes. Celebrity or sports figures are going to tell you what to do? Nope. Plus, I figure most celebrities... Are, are endorsing somebody because they think it's going to benefit them in some way.